These are no ordinary rugby balls. They're made in South Africa, recycling old vinyl billboards, used bags, and other discarded plastic. 16 women have been trained as seamstresses to sew the balls together. Malina Encia says she's glad she's got the work, which pays her 20 rand, just under $3 for every ball. I will be happy to keep on with this project of making balls. It has given me a job and helps me to bring food for my children and to pay their school fees, as well as taking care of my personal needs. The project also employs young people at a rate of 250 rand, about $35 a day, to collect plastic for the balls, so it creates employment and helps get litter off the streets. The nonprofit job training organization called Live helped get the staff up and running. Group founder Russell Porteous hopes the balls, which sell for a lot less than traditional rugby balls, can spread the sport to youngsters. With these balls, they're perfect for training little children because they don't hurt, they don't puncture, <laughs> and you can kick them if you want to. Portia says the popularity of the balls is soaring, with defending champion South Africa seeing success in the current Rugby World Cup. And he and the marketing company that started the program are hoping to build on that in the future. Karen Sloan, The Associated Press.